Hello everybody, welcome back. I literally just finished the other video. Um, so, today I'm going to be playing Onigiri again. Timer started, let's do this. Shut up. Sakuni Zuki, have you ever enhanced a weapon before? If not, allow me to explain a bit of the process. In addition to repairs, I can also help you enhance them. Through enhancing your weapon's attributes, such as its attack power or elemental effect, affinity, will be raised. Ugh. To enhance, all you need to do all you need is another weapon. Anything will do. The the other weapon will be turned into enhancement points and used to upgrade your weapon. The higher the weapon's value, the higher the enhancement points it will yield. In some cases, you'll need a special item for the enhancement. After enhancing a weapon to a certain point, you won't be able to enhance it anymore. In such cases, you'll need another copy of the same weapon in order to enhance it past the limit. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay. Are you following me so far? Well, they say seeing is believing. Give enhancing a try. The weapon reflects you personally. Enhance the weapon to improve yourself. Sakura Inazuki san, there's a beautiful necklace. Lady Shizuka adores accessories, they look good on her too. Oof, <laughs> thank you. I never got bored of looking at them, so I tend to collect a bunch. Yotsune chan likes to collect books, right? That is true, paperbacks uh, that you can read while walking around are particularly nice. I know how uh, I know. How about I bring one of my favorite accessories next time? I bet it'll look great on you, Yoshi Yoshi Chan. Eh? An accessory on me? No, I I'm fine as I am. Thank you. Alrighty. So each character has different preferences for the partner items. It's good to know. Yoshi likes books. Shizuka likes accessories. Evacuation order, let's go. Kekka. <laughs> Evacuation? Monasteries? That's... <laughs> I got it. Thank you for telling me. Monsters? What kind of joke is that? You're serious? Ah, oh, thank you for telling me. I'm getting back to Onigashima. Yes? Huh? Monsters? Oh man, I came here to ask Kikichi Hogan-san to train me too. Uh, thanks for passing it on, monsters. Hmm. Seems unreal. Monsters? Wait, is this about that trimmer from before? Hmm. Oh yeah, evacuation right away. Jeez, I came all the way up to I came all the way to Onigashima for sightseeing. Said to go to Onishigima. Onigashima, you know. Yeah, but about that, I've got to wait for one of my wholesale purchasers to beat me. If I move from here, we'll pass each other by. If, like little, like the ships in the night. I mean, if we don't meet up, I don't have anything to sell. I'm sure he's got something more nearby. But that guy has no sense of direction, so even with the map I gave him. Hey, that's right, you're from Onigashima. There you go. So you know this region pretty well. Eh? What was your name again? Oh, Sakura Izuka san. I know who came, but would you mind having a look around? I don't want to miss him if he does find his way. So I'll just be waiting here. If you find him, bring him here. Of course, there's a reward in it for you. Anyhow, please find him for me. It'll really help out. You always did like to get other people to do your work. Regard. Uh, regardless, uh, we can't uh, afford to not look for this missing merchant. Let us begin a search. Let's 
already been eight. It's already been six minutes. Okay. Yo, Sakura Inazuki, eh? I lost Merchant. Don't know. Can't say I've seen anyone like that. Ah, I think I saw him. Not sure if it's the guy you're looking for or not. Seriously? I didn't see him. <laughs> That's because you were napping. A young man was wandering around earlier. He headed toward the Kokuju Forest. Kokujo. Uh, it was the first time I'd seen him before, so I figured he was a merchant. I haven't seen him come back this way, so it's possible he's just still over there. Hey, what's going on? Anyways, huh? Monster appeared, so there's an evacuation order out? It's not a yokai. Are you serious? What the heck is it? Oh man, nothing like this has ever happened before. Not even once since I started, I just this job. <sighs> I don't really get what's going on. Once you finish away evacuating the folks in the rest area, we're gonna get out of here too, alright? Hurry up and find the guy. Got to Let me get over here. I completely forgot to uh, equip my Kijimuno Estus. And literally, you have to be Estus Flask from Dark Souls. <laughs> Another delicious spirit. What is going on? No, another! Another delicious carrot. Closer. This guy's a little annoying. Come on! What are you doing? 
Excuse me, could you be as kind of guide me to the Gigagahara rest area? It seems I've lost the time. Eh? Were some of my work Yeah, Yay, I was so completely lost. I'm sorry to have caused you so much trouble. Now I can finally get these goods to your son. Would you believe that this is the tenth time I made the trip to Gigagahara? Truly, I cannot make it. What? There's monsters loose and evacuation order was issued? Are you serious? I don't like the sound of this one bit. I'll, I'll just follow you. We're going to the safe place, right? curious about the summer culture in Japan like their summer is our autumn <laughs> I mean like the culture they do stuff related to horror and all that while in the autumn we do stuff related to horror Once I've ever seen this game so dead. There's players here and there, but you're still oh wait, yeah. Hey, thank you. Right, now I can reopen. Seriously, thanks so much. Thanks to you, I can final I finally met up with Man, you just keep getting lost again and again. How many times does this make? I'm sorry, I had no idea things got gotten so crazy. That aside, thank you so very much. And now after all of this uproar, the Onigashi and Anaku traveling store is open. Hala hala get dollar. Oh yeah, that's right. That's right. I can't have you doing all of that for work with nothing. After all, I think this is my time out of all of my players. I think uh, you'll get the most use of it. Music is signed, I really owe you one. So you get a massive dark discount. Uh, come here, come see me when you get back to Onigashima. This voice actor sounds familiar. I'm trying to think of who it is. Kikozu. Kikozu. That's that thing, right?
gonna go to Daku book. So then I have all my stuff in Onigashima. with the delicious carrots. <laughs> Another one! What is with them? I probably have self-aware uh, phone service, so that's funny. <laughs> tell you all a story. So one time I got Mason to get this game and uh, so uh, Mason was doing a dungeon by himself and he was stuck at this one part and he was <laughs> he asked me to come help him out. I was finishing up a quest and then I finally went to go get him and we finished it. I killed the boss with with ease and uh, <laughs> I was like how did you have trouble with this place? This is one of the easiest dungeons. And then I then when we finished, it showed how long it took him to finish that dungeon. It said 15 minutes. 15 minutes to beat an easy dungeon. the idea I should have named this character after um what's her name? That one character from Alol in the Sea who's named after the ocean I think. 
Be funny. Hey, Hmm? A human seeking arrow? In other words, I could simply use this to discover the whereabouts of King Arthur. That's right, that's right. If you shoot this arrow towards the sky, it will redirect itself in the direction of the person you seek. Most excellent. However, I sense limited magical presence. That's right. How discerning you are, young lord. If it gave off a noticeable aura of magic, it would surely be targeted by less than savory types. In fact, masking its true power and looking so ordinary is what makes this arrow truly valuable. I see. That certainly makes a kind of sense. Is anything that full thing true? Can you use your identify from here, Shizuka? Hmm, let me see. Yep, it's a fake. I can't feel anything from it. But now that I'm looking, isn't that the one from Halloween? We have to help her. Ainuzuki-san, let's do something. Will this be enough? Sure, sure. What is this money? I've never seen it before. Wait a minute, is this silver? This is silver, isn't it? Excuse me. Wait, wait Shizuka, you should, you should, I should handle... What the hell do you want? Do you lot want? What? That's just a normal arrow that you're trying to sell, isn't it? There, There isn't even a shred of magical power to it. You've just been lying about this arrow being able to find people so that you can swindle money from her, haven't you? Swindle? Hey, that's a big accusation you're throwing around there. You got any proof of that little missy? Ugh, this is getting us nowhere. Listen, you unwashed scoundrels. I am Minamoto no Yoshitsune, protector of the Kagure Shogunate. You will, sh allow you will show me the powers of this arrow here and now. If you cannot comply, a court magician shall be summoned and you will be summit submit to a full inspection of this item. The Shogunate? Crap, look, I don't know if it's real or not, but you're welcome to. Uh, let's get out of here! Wait. <laughs> They got away. Well, we should be more worried about this woman. It looks like she's had enough. She's had a rough time. Excuse me, are you okay? I was talking to those two fellows about searching for someone when they pulled that arrow out. Was the offer a lie? Unfortunately, yes. It was just a regular arrow. It can't do anything. It likes search for a person. By the way, we met during Halloween. Do you remember? I never got your name. What? Is that right? Looks like I was uh, about to be taken for a fool again. I'm grateful you intervened when you did. Ah uh, yes, the Halloween Festivus uh, and the Skeleton Woman, I remember. I'm Lancelot of the Knights of the Round, loyal servant to the great King Arthur, Lord of Britain. Br Tony? Arthur Knights? Uh, use his uh, title when, it expecting his, when speaking his name. He is King Arthur to you. I apologize, that was rude of me, I think. Hmm. No matter how often I say his name, it doesn't seem to get through. Is it possible that no one here knows of the great King Arthur? Where in the name of Camelot have I come? If you're asking about the name of the country, you're in Japan. J. Pain? Ridiculous. I've never been, a, I've never heard of such a kingdom. Back at you, Britain, was it? Is that the distant country you were talking of when we met, la met last? I've, re I've read in books that there are various countries across the sea. Japan. <laughs> hmm. I know there is this place called Rome, but to think that the world extends even farther than that. Certainly that outfit is not something that you would see around here. That, and that sort of is masterfully crafted, but not from these uh, parts. She's also got a gun. Okay. Ah, you mean Arundite? This blade was bestowed upon me by the Lady of the Lake. Wait, I just realized that's not a normal gun. <laughs> well, it looks a little different, that, but I'm sure inazuka san found a blade that looked a lot like that. Hmm. I identified it as... What was it again? Excalibur or something? What? Did you say Excalibur? This is... Uh, what is the meaning of this? What have you done with my king? 
Eh, what? Uh, I just identified a weapon. I didn't do anything to your king. What has you so worked up? Shizuka, stand back. Answer me, swan. Shizuki san. Finny, watch me. <laughs> You're able to stop my attack? Not bad, but you could uh, still you know, never hold a candle to the king. Why was someone like you wielding a sword of the kings? Of queens? Answer me quickly, knave. Wait, just a moment. The Excalibur that we're talking about is right here. What is this? This is not the blade of my king. What were you thinking, coming at us like that? My apologies, the king's blade is in an Excalibur, so when I heard that you had it, I, I, I was wrong to act as I did. Well, um, it's fine. I can imagine the worry of losing the one you are charged to protect. In any case, uh, could you have, uh, could we have uh, you tell us a little more about the situation? You think it will help? As I said, I'm from the lands of Britain, a knight of King Arthur's Round Table. Not too long ago, I found not too long ago, myself and the other knights were gathered around at the Round the Round Table, with a flash of magnificent lightning and the holy the Holy Grail appeared before our very eyes. Holy Grail. What? You don't even know what, what the Grail is? Grail is a most uh, revered uh, relic, a beautiful chalice. Through the boundless uh, mercy of the sacred relic, uh, all wounds can be healed. Many a knight has requested for the Grail, and yet none have succeeded in making the, with the Grail their own. To be honest, before then I had not even held, laid eyes upon it myself, but when I saw it, I felt something I am unable to express with words. Everyone was dumbstruck. It was as if time had stopped. The king himself did not make a single move. It was then that I started to feel a strange sensation, almost like a premonition of things to come. I reached my hand out to the king, but suddenly the grail emitted a light strong enough, so strong I was forced to shut my eyes, lest I be blinded. My hand never reached the king, and every night in the room slowly faded away. By the time I came to my senses, I was here in this land I did not know. It was also about the time. It was also about then that I spotted these Halloween flyers. I see. It's certainly a tough tale to believe, but I don't think that you are lying to us. Firstly, is there any method of returning to your homeland of Britain? I'm more concerned about the King Arthur's whereabouts. If I suppose that this was the Grail that carried me off into these lands, then the King must have also been taken somewhere. I must look for my King before worrying about my return. Must make sure the king is. No, there is no doubt that he has met no harm. If that is not the case, then I. I see. I don't have the slightest idea of where to begin, but we'll help you along your search for King Arthur. You're in the honest, too, sucker. It's okay. We can't ignore something like this. Really? Of course, right? Inazuki san, we're going to help her. Um, Lance. My name is Lance. Lancelot. Uh, for you to, for all to, for you all to extend a helping hand to someone who drew the sword must mean that the spirit of chivalry is also alive in this land. Chival, my name is Minamoto Yoshitsune. I'm Shizuka. Those are peculiar names indeed. And you, ma'am, you must be Sakura Inazuki. Sorry about earlier, Sakura Inazuki. Thank you. By the way, I have been wondering, actually, what is it? That blade of yours, in case you haven't noticed, it's been flashing since a while back. What? what? My erudite is also depending on the directions you're facing. The light seems to become brighter or fade. This kind of thing has never... I see. If I hold it this way, or how about this direction, what direction does it shine its brightest? Want to go check it out? Yes, I believe we should. Erudite has always guided and protected me. Must be the divine protected protection of the lake. Let us follow the light. Be careful, eh, Shizuka. Yeah, yeah. You don't have to tell me every time you know. Let's go, Inazuki san, Lancelot san. Sometimes you wish to play a battle for all the dungeons that she was taken to during this quest. Okay. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna drink some water. Drink. Reading all that is getting me dehydrated. So I apologize for this being a rather uneventful episode. I'm having these at most like 45 minutes.
Huh? You cleaned the Deku Cave seriously? Well, not bad for a beginner. <laughs> uh, yeah, I know. I'll give you this Magatama time as a prize, so you should just sort of rest for a bit, okay? Okay? You too. I prefer streaming. I could talk less then, because no one ever watches my streams, but during a video I have to talk because, well, obvious. Oh, oh Sakura Nizuki, has everyone been evacuated from the rest area? Good, good. You have my thanks. Sakura Nizuki, I went to and looked into the comic way that was sealed here in Onigashima. According to the records, it seems that 200 years ago on this very island, the gods worked together with the Oni living here at the time. The goal was to seal away monsters, monsters chemically with the appearance of a five-headed dragon. The fiery breath, breath roaring it forth from each of its jaws, it scorched it with the land. One sweep of its tail could fell, fell a hundred warriors. The name they gave for this dreadful Kamikui was Tiamat. Should this Kamikui ever reign free, it shall reign destruction with terrible force throughout the land. This is what was written in the annals of Onigashima. Sakura Inazuki, I have something I must ask you. It is a test of the utmost gravity. We cannot allow the Kamikui that was once sealed here to roam free. Already hushed whispers about them spread across the land. Rumors of the Kamikui's revival. I ask that you embark on a journey to drive the Kamikui back wherever they may be. It shames to me to say this, but my body is no longer fit for battle. Amongst the younger islanders, there are those who don't even know how to hold a weapon. The truly sorry state of affairs we find ourselves in. But you, you are different. I can feel it from you. You can gain the power to tear asunder the heavens, to rend the earth. The time that has come for you to use that power for the God of, good of the world. Your travels will give you a goal and help you nurture your abilities. I trust that you will succeed. Of course, I'm going to lend a hand whenever I can. After all, your opponent is an ancient evil. Involve saving the people from Kamikui, then count me in. What? You're sending Sakura and Izuki san to fight against those terrible beasts alone. I can't just stand around doing nothing when someone I know is out there risking their life. I'm sure that I'll be able to help with something. Besides, the comic we took my precious hair ornament, I have to get it back. Th this is the plan that you meant? No, you cannot go, I will not allow it. If you are worried about the comic we, then I will go in your stead, stead, and I will bring back your hair ornament. I know. But if I don't do this myself, then none of this means anything. Enough of this nonsense. Why are you being so unreasonable? There is absolutely no reason for someone of your position to put themselves at risk. You are the Shogun family's sole princess. And what do I have to show for it? I'm nothing more than uh, a doll. I've lived my life as a pet would. Well, I've noticed something. Please uh, hear me out, Yoshitsune-chan. I was raised without one. Anything I asked for was given for me, to me. I grew up to thinking that was normal for everyone. After all, I, after I was old enough, I began to sneak out of the castle. Then did I understand how wrong I was. I saw yokai and villains alike, devastated towns, harm innocence, and I even, I even met impoverished children of my own age. Despite all of the pain and grievances they bore, I have seen these people find joy through those mo these most difficult times. I lived my life in a false world, far removed from theirs. I was kept hidden, blinded, and deafened by luxury. But I want to live in a world that is real, with Sakura inazuki san and Yoshitsune chan If you desire it that strongly, then I am in no position to stop you. It's certainly not in the interest of the Shogunate to leave, uh, resurrect the Kamikuri on the loose. 
However, I have one condition, Lady Shizuka. Should the situation turn life-threatening, you are to follow my every order. Do you understand? If you cannot accept this condition, then I will not allow you to participate in this quest. <laughs> okay, your Tsunichen, are you angry with me? Are you sure about this? Lady Shizuka may have run away from home, but she is still the Shogunate's princess. There is no need to worry. Lady Shizuka understands the basics of combat. Furthermore, I too will be accompanying her. Should anything dare to threaten her, I shall lay waste to it, even if my foe were a comic book. It's just like you said. These gravels uh, give uh, these travels give one clear goal. I expect the princess to will grow much along the way. Mizuki, <laughs> you've got your work cut out for you now. Eliminating the Kamiku with both princess and a warrior in tow. Since we've gotten that settled, it's time for you to get ready to depart the island and see the world. As you know, our customs dictate that we only cannot travel into any lands past Sakurajima. Only a handful of only that I recognize as being particularly gifted are allowed an exception. While I may have uh, entrusted you with an important task, this trial is no trivial to trivial to. You must test your strength against Lord of the Kishin Din, as so many have only have done before you. He will most likely attempt to crush you using the weight of his massive body. However, I have faith that you will be able to withstand his attacks. So go forth, beat it down, and open your path to the world. I'm learning so much about the story now. <laughs> oh, it's Sakura Inuzuki. I see you've been hard at work. It pleases to be able to witness your growth firsthand. Sakura Nizuki, I've prepared a little something for you. Consider it a parting gift. Take this squid nigiri. I think it will come in handy. Keep up the good work. Alright, here we go. Finishing up the tutorial. Even I have difficulty in this room sometimes. And there's specifically another room. I think it's this room. He's only on the hell difficulty. Yes. Oh, the chief says these things look like ducks. Ooh. Or chickens, I can't remember. Either way, they would never look either. need a key to open this gate, Goron. I can open the left gate for you now, Goron. Go further and uh, find the key, Goron. This is the room, though. It gets annoying.
Not this one, but the next one. Probably the enemies in here. Cheesy with a bow. Little dog, just get them all together and then use one of the bigger attacks. This is the one, okay. This is where I was talking about, not the other part of it. It's only annoying for lower level people. Chief Dorama. I wish each of the bosses had their own thing. Not like not all of the bosses, but like the main bosses, like Chief Dorama. I mean, some of the bosses have their own thing. But... He's got some annoying attacks. Okay, uh, I'm gonna end this here and then I'm gonna fight the boss.